Imagine a creature so strange that it doesn't have a mouth or a stomach, yet it thrives by feeding on bones in the darkest depths of the ocean. Meet the zombie worm, also known as the bone-eating snot flower. These mysterious worms were first uncovered in 2002 during a deep-sea expedition, where researchers found them feasting on whale bones. In the pitch-black, icy waters, these worms use root-like appendages to burrow into the bones, relying on symbiotic bacteria to digest fats and oils, an astonishing adaptation that defies imagination. Their appendages resemble delicate flowers, a stark contrast to the gruesome nature of their diet. But the wonders of the zombie worm don't stop there. Male zombie worms much tinier than females live inside the females' bodies and serve only one purpose, reproduction. Once they fertilize the females' eggs, the males die off, completing their strange life cycle. This extreme sexual dimorphism is one of the many bizarre traits of these deep-sea dwellers who have adapted to survive in one of the most inhospitable places on Earth. There are over 30 known species of zombie worms, each specialized in feeding on different types of bones. These creatures, which can grow up to 2 inches long, live about a year. While they consume bones, their survival is intimately connected to the nutrient-rich carcasses they break down. The symbiotic relationship with bacteria is their key to unlocking the nutrients within bones, enabling them to endure in these depths. Fascinated by creatures that defy nature's expectations? Be sure to subscribe for more jaw-dropping discoveries from the deep ocean. Zombie worms are found as deep as 10,000 feet, right on the ocean floor, where light never reaches and the temperatures are bone-chillingly cold. Against all odds, they've adapted to the pitch-black frozen abyss. Despite having no obvious defenses, their isolated habitat protects them from many surface-level threats. However, predators like snails do feed on them, reminding us that even in the deep life is a constant struggle. But if the deep sea holds creatures like this, what other marvels await us? For example, on land, the pitcher plant traps and dissolves its prey in a slow, deadly process. Want to dive into this botanical killer? Check out our video and discover the deadly world of the pitcher plant. And now you know, stay curious.